Y'all get ready? Yes, you get Y'all ready. We are gathered here today to sip some tea, honey. So make sure you guys have your teacups ready because this tea is what? Piping hot. Hey you guys, I hope you guys are doing good today and it's time for another lovely TTV shout out. So I wanna go ahead and shout out carmarshall.com. They have over 100,000 cars from dealers to choose from. All you have to do is go to their website, you shop, they negotiate. All of their information will be pinned down below. Make sure you guys check them out. So anyways, you guys, there is so much baby news going on. So I want to come on here and break everything down to you guys. So if you guys don't know, for months it's been rumored and Kenya did admit on the reunion show that she was pregnant. <laughs> is that a question? No, uh, we're we're a all question. waiting. We will definitely be welcoming a boy or girl oh. in late this year. But a lot of people were giving her a lot of backlash. A lot of folks didn't believe her. They were saying, you know what, she's probably, you know, using a surrogate. She's probably lying. She's looking for attention. Well, this weekend, Kenya Moore decided to take the Instagram to show the world her baby bump. And she looked gorgeous. I want you guys to go ahead and check out this picture right here. All right, so you guys just saw Kenya Moore's baby bump. So now I hope the internet puts to rest all of these fake baby bump rumors and these fake pregnancy rumors and let Kenya Moore enjoy her pregnancy, okay? This woman is in her 50s. She's having her first child and she looks good, okay? So now in other baby news, if you guys remember a month ago, I had reported about Black China and her little young boyfriend, 18 year old Almighty J. So rumor had it a month ago that she was pregnant and then a few days later, Black China came out and she denied it. She claimed she wasn't pregnant but now the rumors are heating back up because recently black china and tyga they were spotted going to king's kindergarten graduation at his school and you can clearly see some type of bump her belly button looks to be poking out and they're saying that black china is reportedly three months pregnant by almighty j i want you guys to go ahead and check out these pictures this entire situation is a hot damn mess check this out and i'm gonna come back with the rest of my commentary Black China, close your vagina. Honey, in my personal opinion, yes, she does look pregnant, okay? I don't know what kind of bloating would make you look about three to four months, especially being that her stomach is usually flat from all that damn liposuction she keeps having. So she definitely does look pregnant to me. But I think what's more disturbing, you know, let, let's put aside the fact that this woman is damn near 30 and she's supposedly pregnant by an 18-year-old, okay? That's already disturbing. But what's more disturbing is the fact that she went to a kindergarten graduation dressed like a damn thot, okay? Why are you going to a kindergarten graduation with your titties out? You know what I mean? The, with, with a tight-ass dress on? You mean to tell me she couldn't just put on some jeans and a t-shirt and just been a regular schmegler mom and some sneakers? It's like, why do these, you know, Z-list celebrities feel the need to do the most as opposed to, you know, making about their child and being a parent first, okay? But I do feel like she is pregnant and that she tried to dead the rumors, you know, because she didn't want it coming out so early. But she does indeed look pregnant in those pictures. It's going to be very interesting to see how this plays out. At this point in time, she has a baby by Tyga. She has a baby by Rob Kardashian. And, and now she's allegedly pregnant by this 18-year-old. I feel like she's doing nothing more but chasing a child support check. You know what I'm saying? She's trying to get herself secured for the next 18 years. 18 years, 18 years, and on her 18th birthday found out it wasn't his. Now I ain't saying she a gold digger, uh, but she ain't messing with no broke. So it's going to be very interesting to see how much child support she ends up getting from him once they end up breaking up because you know the relationship is not going to last, okay? So anyways, in other damn baby news, you guys don't know, y'all remember Felon Babe, a.k.a. Jeremy Meeks, a.k.a. the biracial male version of Black China? Well, if you guys do not know, like I told y'all a few months ago, he secured the bag by knocking up heiress Chloe Green, and now they've given birth to their son. So this entire situation is crazy. I want you guys to go ahead and check out this post that Chloe Green posted on her Instagram page. Check this out. So this is what Chloe Green wrote. She says, We are pleased to announce the birth of our beautiful baby boy, Jaden Meeks Green, born May 29, 2018. Mommy and baby both doing well. We kindly ask to respect our privacy, please. Much love, Chloe and Jeremy. 
All right, so like I said, Jeremy Meeks, he done secured that bag. But Chloe Green, I'm going to need you to have a tall glass to shut the fuck up. First of all, nobody's checking for you or this damn felon, okay? Second of all, if you wanted your privacy respected, maybe you should have kept the post to yourself and not taken the social media to tell the world that you gave birth, okay? Nobody's checking for y'all like that. Your privacy will definitely be respected because you're nothing more than a homewrecker and he's a loser and karma's a bitch, okay? So yeah, I know that was kind of shady, but I have no respect for Jeremy Meeks or Chloe green because let's not forget when Jeremy Meeks was creeping on his wife and, and was fucking Chloe on the side he got both of these women pregnant at the same time but when he left his wife Melissa Meeks to go be with Chloe she ended up having a miscarriage so this baby's a slap in the face to his original wife who held his ass down who was there through his damn bed okay so I don't want to hear that privacy shit bitch okay you wasn't worried about privacy when you was fucking somebody else's husband and getting pregnant by them okay but in other news Melissa Meeks is saying that she's very devastated stated by the birth of this child but she is happy that their divorce is finally finalized and they are no longer married the divorce was just finalized june 6th okay so jeremy meeks is a straight up dog and so is chloe green and just know that karma is real so i have no respect for either one of these people but with that being said congratulations on the bundle of joy the baby did nothing the baby didn't ask to be here so i'm not gonna say nothing bad about the baby but screw both of the parents okay but with that being said congrats on the new bundle of joy so anyways, that's all I have in baby news today, okay? So let me know your thoughts on all of this baby news. Do you believe that Black China is really pregnant by Almighty J? How do you feel about Kenya Moore finally shutting down all the haters and showing the world that she is indeed pregnant and carrying her own child? And then how do you feel about messy-ass Chloe Green basically posting a picture of her child, letting the whole world know that she gave birth, and then demanding privacy? Girl, if you don't sit your secondhand celebrity having ass down somewhere, Chloe Green. Hi, I'm Chloe Green, and welcome to my hello show. Anyways, y'all, let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. All right, deuces. Hey you guys, it's your girl T and I hope you really enjoyed that video. If you want to know more about my look of the day or if you want a way to contact me concerning advertisement and sponsorship deals, definitely feel free to click my description box. There's plenty of information in there. Please stay tuned for the next video. Talk to y'all later.